Hey, welcome back guys. Um, so today we are going to build a completely beginner friendly automation using NA10. Uh, as you can see on my screen, uh, you know, we are doing this thing. Uh, when I send a chat message uh, that goes to OpenAI and OpenAI do some action based on our input and it and after that it posts to uh, LinkedIn. So it's, it's completely beginner friendly. It's, it's, it's so simple. Uh, let me do it in action. So when you when I send this message, please create a LinkedIn post about a agents. Open a do that specific action based on our input, and immediately after that is done, that will post to LinkedIn. Now let me go to my LinkedIn. At the moment, you can see we don't have any posts here. Let me refresh the screen. And now you should be able to see what we have automated. There you go. So this is what we are going to build today. Okay, so I am in N810 dashboard. Uh, there are two ways you can use N810. Uh, first one is self-hosted and the second one is cloud. Self-hosted is completely free. Uh, you can install it in, in your machine, but you are responsible for the installation and maintaining the whole infrastructure. The second one is cloud. That is the easiest way to do. Uh, you don't need to worry about any infra setup or anything, the installation or anything. You can use it directly, but that comes with a cost. You have to pay a monthly subscription fees for that. Uh, but that's easy. Uh, but if you are a new subscriber then you will get two weeks of free uh, trial that will be more than enough to play around now let us build from scratch and we can add at the first step most of the time the first step is a trigger some kind of action that can be a chat or uh, that can be any change in your google sheet for example or when you receive an email uh, any sort of those things so when something happened then trigger this one so in our case the first step is um, the chat so let's add that first step click on add first step and search for chat chat trigger now the chat trigger has been added uh, let us test that first step click on chat here and hey so you can see that node has been executed successfully then which means uh, this node um, is capable of getting any chat messages which we are uh, sending. Now we need to send the chat message to OpenAI. For that we need to have an OpenAI node. Come here, search for OpenAI and select create an assistant. And first you need to connect your OpenAI account. For that, you need to have an OpenAI key. If you don't have one already, come to platform.openai.com and here you need to top up some amount. If you remember it correctly, you need to have minimum $5. Once that top up, come to API keys and generate one secret key here. Once that is ready, go back to NA10 and click on create new credential and just fill your IPA key, just that, and save it. As I have one already, I've selected that one, and the resource is text, because we are sending text input to open a model, and message a model, because we are sending a message to an LLM model. And from list, select a model of your choice. I'm selecting GPT-4 here. And text, this text is actually the output from previous node that's the output from the chat so to get that let's go back to canvas and just send and you now add a dummy message once again and now the chat has received the input and it is doing some action uh, with open AI. as we are not sending any text or the input which we want it generates some random text but this is not what we want we want the output of chat uh, node to get that double click on open a node and you can see we have received the input 
this is basically the output of chat node and just drag that to text here now this text is the instruction to open AI that is this question hey can you please generate LinkedIn post to AI agent let us try that now the input to open AI is this question and it, it generates a content this one and this is relevant to our question okay now next step is we need to send this content which openai generates to linkedin let's do that okay i'm um, back to the canvas and here okay let me clear this once move it a bit left and uh, let's add the next node that is um, the linkedin node search for linkedin here and select create post uh, i think video is covering that area a bit okay and uh, create post here first you need, you need to connect to your linkedin account i have already connected uh, but uh, what you can do is select create new credential and uh, just disable uh, organization support and click on connect to my account so here uh, it will ask for your username and password uh, let me connect, create new connection okay and just sign in and the connection is successful sometimes it, it will ask for the permission so you can just approve it so this has been connected and uh, linkedin account too and uh, just close that you can see this has been connected uh, and the resource is post because we are posting to LinkedIn and operation is create and post as person uh, you can see this error fetching options from LinkedIn if you see that message what you should do is select organization then uh, select back person then you should be able to see your name here just select that and now the text is the previous notes output uh, that is the message uh, sorry the content which open it generates so that's a text text we want here because we are posting that text to linkedin uh, we'll do that in a bit and media category select as none because we are um, just posting a text not an image or anything you can see here the post does not contain any media and will only consist of text so just select none if you want to image uh, if you want to post image you can select image as well but for now i'm selecting none here and now we need to get the uh, previous uh, output so for that we can just run execute previous node I just send the message uh, okay just try once again and open it generate something takes a bit and now uh, the LinkedIn uh, node um, has been executed successfully, but we are not uh, sending anything because the, the text field we have at the moment is empty. Uh, what we need is this content. So just drag that content here. Okay. Uh, we can test that step here. Uh, let's try that once. okay now the node executed successfully we got the URN back and we got this content as well let us go to LinkedIn and refresh to see the content we got that is exciting news from the world of technology let's see that has been posted there okay we can see that post we got this empty post the reason because we executed step without adding the text that's the reason we got this empty post here okay now we can see this is working fine okay and uh, go back and save now let us test this uh, end to end uh, this thing will send a different message hey can you please create a LinkedIn post about how a 
uh, it looks like in the year uh, 2050 just, just for an example okay send it it took the message open i started generating in the content based on our um, input takes a bit and once that is generated we can see that has been posted to linkedin let's go back to linkedin once again let's refresh the page and we should be able to see the generated content here let it load okay there you go feature gazing a in 2050 awesome this is how you can automate the linkedin post in you know, with zero code now uh, this involves a button a chat trigger here what you can do is in real time if you want to grow uh, your followers base in social media linkedin is just an example you can do it in uh, many other social medias um, i'm creating content of uh, those things um, in the upcoming upcoming days uh, but in real time what you can do is you can schedule a job here uh, and that goes and fetch the trending topics uh, in the internet and gets that uh, trending topic and generate a content out of that and it posts to social media that's one thing you can do to grow uh, your your um, followers base so uh, that's it for today guys if you like the video uh, please uh, subscribe me and give me a thumbs up and if you like to have more automation like this about if you, you know if you, if you have any specific topic in mind uh, please feel free to comment that in the comment box so i can uh, include that in i, I can try to in, include that in the next uh, uh, videos so thanks for guessing, uh, watching guys have a, a nice day